Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This reading for today, Scorpio. This is a love message. This is a love reading for you, Scorpio. I hope you are doing well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today, Scorpio, this is for you. Let us see what is happening towards Scorpio. What is the guided love message for the Scorpio sign? What is the message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is for the sign of Scorpio. Please. What's the guided message for the Scorpio sign? What's the love message for Scorpio, please? Why? <laughs> you have the devil card. Ooh, the devil is falling in love, Scorpio. You have the devil card. The six of pentacles. Okay. This is interesting. You get the justice card. You'll be dealing with a Libra. And the hierophant card. The chariot card. Wow, Scorpio. Oh my gosh. This is like Lucifer falling in love with you. The Ten of Cups, the Four of Wands. Oh, why do you have a Three of Swords? Oh my gosh, Scorpio, let's see. Okay, first of all, Scorpio, you could be dealing with a Capricorn. You could be dealing with, you could be dealing with Cancer, Taurus, Libra. It could be any sign, but, you know, those are very strong in the reading. Those signs are very strong in the reading today. So, what's coming towards you, Scorpio? It feels like it's about time, you know? The devil card. So, there's a person, a romantic situation that, you know, if there's a smoke, there is fire, Okay? It means that this person, this this person, this this person, a romantic situation. You've known them. You you've known them. The devil card in here. Let's see. The four of pentacles. This person or romantic situation that is connected to you in the next three to seven days, Scorpio. They've been holding back. Okay. It feels like they've been holding back for quite some time now. Um, this devil card, they've been holding back four of coins or four of pentacles in here. And it feels like it's about time that they give. Like it's about time to unleash the devil card, unleash the devil in them. Okay. There's something, there's a situation that's about to come into you. The magician card, look at that double magician card. Magician, magician. I feel like this person is guilty, okay? Double magician card. Um, This person, this is a person. This is your person. You know, they have a letter B or V. They have a very beautiful smile. Scorpio, this person, you like their smile. You like them smiling. They're more beautiful when they smile. You like the the jawline or the shape of their face more specifically when this person smile. You're very attracted to this person. The devil card. There's something... You know, this is a person or romantic situation where... They don't want to show you, Scorpio, that they could really take a relationship seriously, you know. Because the devil card, the magician card, the magician card again. Because four of pentacles, six of pentacles, it's more of a, I don't know, I feel like this person is testing you. It feels like this person is testing you to a point where not really playing hard to get or playing Cupid, but They can really go and be in a relationship with you. You got this person, Scorpio, at some point. It's a it's a reading where 
no matter how they act like a devil, it won't work with you. Okay, the devil card, the magician card. This is a person that they're acting a devil and you know how to discipline a devil. Okay, this is a person who you can really get into their head. I would say Scorpio. You can get into their head and no matter how they act like a devil, high horse, pride, ego, you have moved or you've got some language or you've got some hold towards them, Scorpio, where you can get into them. And with you, they can really like you can caught them in the act okay this devil card magician card in here the six of pentacles yeah four of swords four and four again i would say you just know this person so well you know when to exit and you know when to let them in okay you know them you know how to handle the devil card in here and this devil card, you know, the more you hate, the more you love. Something like that vibe. I feel like you break up growling at each other or you break up the last conversation, the last thing that you said or they said wasn't nice for some of you guys. But it's, it's kind of a fight and flight mode, Scorpio, okay? Five of coins, four of coins, five of coins, four of swords. You see, if you look at the number, Scorpio, six, five, four, four. You know what? It, it doesn't spike up. You know, it doesn't spike up to, to seven. You have three, three, four, five, six, you know, three, four, five, six. You know why? Because I feel like you're just going around with the devil. There's a person, a romantic situation. You did not get along. There was some misunderstanding. There's probably a breakup in here. You're going circle. They have not moved on. You know, imagine a person who told you, Scorpio, Scorpio, I'm getting out of here. And you're like, okay, the door is not locked. You can, you know, get yourself. You can get out. You know, the person, I'm going to get out of here. Okay, the door is not locked. You get out. You help yourself out. So they went out, but they're just in front of your, they're just in front of your house. You know, it's metaphorically, they make you feel that I'm going to move on. I'm moving on, but they're just there. This is a person who, it's the devil, it's the ego that is speaking into them and the thing about this person a romantic situation scorpio you know it's they can it's like reverse psychology or it's a feeling of not not you scorpio but the more they someone in here it could also be you i'm about to sneeze sorry guys let me just get my alcohol but it feels like this it feels like this personal romantic situation it's kind of that vibe the more you hate the more you love or it's the devil card it's the opposite because there's something magical about your connection like it's a person who and you too you guys both of you are acting like devil, but someone is going to initiate like devil, but magician, ma devil, magician card, magician card, and then a four of sword. So you guys are acting both devil, maybe because of whatever you said, they said, but there's a low vibe. There's a very, there's a very strong, low vibe energy between the two of you okay but the thing is you know they're not going anywhere so this person makes you feel like i'm going let's break up goodbye 
but they're just outside your house waiting you know it's a feeling of it's a feeling of they just walk out so they will walk back just this card it's a feeling of there's a devil the devil walk out they will come back you know it's it's temporary something tells me something someone is just going around in here they what they said to you is that i'm never going to talk to you again metaphor you know it feels it 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 they made you say they made they they said something or it could be you but this reading tells me i'm not going to talk to you i'm going to cut you off this will be the last time or goodbye 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 but it's not it's they're just somewhere in the corner it's so close the justice card scorpio yeah the devil card again look at that repeating five of repeating cards devil card devil card something tells me there's an echo like an echo it means that you guys are not moving towards the next level because if they give you the devil you also give them the devil like if this person throw you this you throw it back to them But there's so much love you know the thing with you is that you can argue 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 or disconnect argue disconnect but at the end of the day they come home to you queen of cups you know what i'm hearing the word this person is dating for a commitment okay yeah ace of pentacles look at that You're still their favorite. Even though this person is acting like this, you are still their favorite. You are still the one who's very, very connected to them emotionally. Something tells me that it pays off to be a Scorpio, that you, that you call them out if they act like this. You don't tolerate them if they act like this. Because it's like, disciplining somebody or someone because this devilish energy it's coming to an end from devil card to magician card like this is a player attitude someone is graduating from their player attitude scorpio they're tired someone is tired with their player attitude and i'm also getting i don't know i'm kind of picking up this vibe where this person is acting like an arse, but they're not. Justice card, the Hierophant card. Like this person, Scorpio. They're scared to show you that they have a Queen of Cups. It's part of, it feels like, you know, it feels like I don't want to give you Scorpio. Like, I don't, I want to intimidate you. Like this person, like, I want to intimidate you. I want to confuse you. I want to show you this so they can trigger you to show your Scorpio vibe. And you will. You sting, you know. You sting them. Oh, really? You trigger me? Oh, this is my sting. And then, whoa, they even, they're attracted to your, <laughs> they're, they're attracted to your darkness, to be honest with you. You guys can really get the darkness, the devil out of each other. You can get. You, like, this is a reading where they can what is that saying that you you know they can bring out the worst in you this person can bring out the worst in you and you can bring out the worst the worst in them you you can bring out the darkness in them they can bring out the darkness in you but there's no hiding like this is so transparent you want darkness i'll give you darkness but it won't leave you it won't leave it's a it's a reading where you won't second guess like you they won't let you second guess or wander around you would see straight away the transparency of your connection it doesn't work doesn't work you know if it works it works because they're back and how however there's no more devil energy left i'm kind of picking up that look scorpio I have unleashed all of the devil energy and I will graduate with that justice card, the Hierophant card. They will show you the side of them where they can really commit.
okay someone is gonna approach you and they don't bring the devil anymore they're done with the devil energy it's 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 a it's a reading where you guys went to the worst you know but it's gone chariot card the hierophant card yeah you have an emperor now this person is like okay i do understand you now and i think you do understand me there's there's no reason to be a devil. It's a person who is very defensive. Like they show you first their devil side. And then you survive dealing with the devil. Okay, it's time to show you the emperor. And besides, this person's like, okay, enough of the devil. That's so um, heavy. Justice card. Justice card, the emperor card. This is a completely different vibe. Someone who is acting like a player who's acting like two-faced, not two-faced actually, they're so, what you see is what you get, but this person is going to drop the devil, they want to be okay with you, they want to date for a commitment, the emperor card, you know, this, this person can handle you, I would say this person like to manage you, you know, Scorpio, if, you know, Scorpio, this person would like to be the alpha, I'm kind of picking up this five for quite some time now, you have nine of swords, I think in their other relationship, they're the alpha, you know. I don't think they will be an alpha for a very long time. You guys are equal, four of wands. And now I have, I went through, now I'm kind of feeling the three of swords in here. This person, okay, I'll tell you. The reason why this person shows the devil, because they've got a personality that they would like to take over, okay. This person... In terms of a lover, they're the alpha. They want to take over. They like control. My, my emperor card. Okay. But they met you. And that attitude of being the devil, being the emperor. You know, this is bossy. Okay. This person, they cannot be the devil or they cannot act the way they act in the past. In their previous relationship, they're the emperor. They're the alpha, they're the devil, they're, they're the spoiled brat. It works for the others or it doesn't work. They left them, you know, their previous relationship, you know, leave them. With you and they met you, they showed you that side, the devil card, the emperor card, the spoiled brat, but also a good lover, you know, when they're in a good mood. But regardless of this, there's a goodness in this person, but there's also something uncontrolled and unyielding, like they're temperamental. They could, it could be controlled, okay? Now, this person, the thing is, your combination made them realize that with you, Scorpio, I can be an alpha today. Tomorrow, you can be the alpha. So this person realized that they can no longer act as a three of swords. They cannot act or it's a person who I cannot show you. I cannot bring with you, Scorpio, my previous attitude. The devil card could be third party. It could be bossy. It could be controlling. could be manipulating. If I want you, I've got to drop those following, you know, devil card, emperor card in here. Because you are my equal. Two and two. That's an equal. Two of Wands, Two of Wands. You guys bring together a happy life, a happy wife, a happy marriage, a happy man, you know, Four, four of Wands. Because if they manipulate, if they control, if they if they take over so much, the, the Three of Swords will come. And this Three of Swords, it is you, <laughs> Scorpio. Their attitude... Their player attitude, their attitude, their behavior, it will never work. Because you call them out. You're a Scorpio. It's a reading where they can never have you. If they bring you something of a devil or manipulative or brat. Because if they bring that to you, you give them the three of swords. I would say they can't cross you. Okay? They can befriend you. They can make you fall in love. But if they cross you, you bring the three of swords. You know, like, you know, don't cross Scorpio. In a, in a metaphor way, 
Like they realize that you are the one person that they will never cross. They realize the right love. You know, this person is realizing how to love with you. That, okay, sunshine, this is the right love because I'm surrendering my devil, my three of swords, my emperor because of my Scorpio. I guess this is love, okay? Someone has been acting immaturely, three of swords, emperor card, low vibe energy. And they realize that if I continue to act this way, I will never have Scorpio. I've got to drop those to get Scorpio. Because every time I act this way, I give a three, I get a three of swords from Scorpio. You call them out, you sting them. You know? What is that? It feels like it feels like you know that stick. So this is your person. Zzz, you give them that stick. Zzz, ouch. Okay, you're acting a devil. Zzz, mm. You electrocute this until every time they act like a devil. Zzz, Z, z, until they release that they become magician so now they know how to love properly it's a person who is like now you know how to behave properly in front of a lady or a man you thought them well you know some lovers their previous relationship they just they gave up with them you know, that's the storyline here is that their previous lovers gave up. You know, you didn't. I think you did. But before you gave up, you sting them. You told them like, this is not a nice behavior. You know, you called them out. You, you just didn't took off. You also called them up. You know, this is not good. Blah, blah, blah. But here they come. Lesson learned. Devil is out. Magician is in. Is scared to do something not nice because you bring the three of swords. Prepare Scorpio. You have now a person who's ready to commit to you. And um, yeah, this person is very persuasive. Um, the Hierophant card. They date for marriage. Prepare Scorpio. So this is your reading. Thank you so much, Scorpio, for coming back. Thank you so much for being here. I will connect with you soon again, guys. You have a great day. Bye-bye.